we've now got some falling fruit and a catcher that moves with the arrow keys. The next step is to make them interact. So we want the catcher to acquire points when he catches a piece of fruit. Um, to do that, we're going to have to create a variable, make a variable for all sprites, and I'm going to call it score. Um, and for each of your falling items, well, actually, first of all, let's go to the stage and let's make sure that when the green flag is clicked, we're going to set the score to zero. That will return the score to zero every time it starts, every time the game starts. Um, then for each of your fruits, new script, when the green flag is clicked, forever. And we need a sense because it needs to be ah, forever if, rather. Excuse me, forever if. If touching catcher, hide, and variables again, change score by one. Now, this is where you can get creative with your game because you could have. Um, let's say a master prize, a really special prize that's worth five points, but it doesn't turn up as often. Now to do that, you would change the wait number of seconds to, um, let's say, a higher number, so 10 to 15, so it only turns up every 10 to 15 seconds instead of every one to five. And you would change, change score by one to change score by five or 10 or whatever you wanted. Um, it's playing around with these numbers that help you fine-tune your gameplay. I'm just going to duplicate that onto my other sprite as well, and then we're going to see if it works. So, I'll click the green flag, the score goes to zero, move my catcher around, I missed those bananas because they were falling quite quickly, oh, disappeared, increased my score, caught those, missed those, then we catch this, and so on and so on you can really customize your game here with your randoms and your scores to make it more interesting have prizes have booby prizes let's say the crisps were unhealthy food and you shouldn't catch them you could change the score on them for change score by minus one and that would work as well so your score would go down if you caught an unhealthy food um, it's up to you to have a play and start to um, tweak your gameplay, like I say. So have a go.